Everybody's rocking the white right now. So this is him, you know, lit right now. He is obviously a stoner too. Look at them red eyes, man. Look at those red eyes. But look at those tattoos. Like he look lit as fuck. Come in our house because we wearing the same goddamn shirt, bitch. <laughs> Hello everybody, welcome back to a brand new series here on my channel. My name is Trick the Titan and I'm so proud, so happy, so freaking excited to be announcing this series for you. Okay, so if you, if, you, if you are brand new to my channel, then click that subscribe button and click that like button right now because you will be here for a long ride. Also, if you guys like the shirt that I'm wearing, it is me, it is my channel logo, it is my name, hopefully you all can see. You guys can click the link below, spread shirt, and buy my merchandise, it is here. So whenever I do a Facebook video, hopefully I'll try to be wearing your shirt, it will be lit. And also subscribe to my vlog channel, because I do weekly videos on a weekly, okay? But here today, oh first of all, I'm still in college, you guys. It is getting down to the nitty gritty. When I say we're leaving out of here in like two weeks, it is May 6th. And it's 4.54 a.m. I'm so freaking tired. But, hey, my roommate is gone for the weekend, so I'm going to take advantage of it. I've been preparing this series for a few weeks now. I'm really excited about it. And this is my nuisance for a Let's Play. As I get so bored with City Life, you guys. Or City Living, or whatever it was called. City Living? Is it called City Living? uh -huh. Yeah, it just shows goes to show you that I just really don't care. But um yeah, this is my brand new series. It's called Brown Sugar. Now, Brown Sugar is an old movie that came out in 2002. It's a, you know, it's a black movie and it's a, basically it's a love thing. They were good friends and then they grew separate lives, you know, dated other people, built their careers and all this stuff, but they, you know, later on in the movie they that love is still there and basically it's like it's we're not gonna be dealing with the hip-hop aspect of the movie but you know um shout out to my girl Alexis Ariel you know I love you and you know I love to shade you right <laughs> it's an inside joke but you guys yeah brown sugar is a series all oh, not it's not solely based off the movie it's loosely based off of the movie but yeah the only thing that's coming from the movie is that they're lifetime friends and they are now a couple and making it in the city so the sugar aspect you know brown because they you know black love and the sugar is like you know it has a kick to you too much of it can make you sick but just enough can be real sweet <laughs> but yeah these are my sims you guys i'm gonna do a quick little tour these are my two sims i love them so much when i say i've been trying to perfect i mean perfect i'm sorry i'm a little bit slow i've been trying to per perfect them so well like you guys tell me if you guys want want certain cc just let me know and i'll see if i can find it if not <laughs> which i don't know but yeah, these are my two sims i'll show you the names and the trace later because i don't freaking remember but let's go through the house, okay? We're going to look at the house first. I'm going to look at the Sims because I worked so hard in this house. They live in, of course, an apartment. And they live in the Spice Market. I never lived there before, so this would be interesting. Oh, God, can the game not be fucking laggy? Because that is not the move. It's really not what I want to do. So walking into the apartment, this is the door. You immediately see our kitchen area. So this is our kitchen area. Let me, can I rise a little bit? Because this is our kitchen area, you know, where we got a table, we got to eat because for real though, we got to eat, we got to have the hot sauce, barbecue sauce, monster. We got notepads because you always got to write some shit down for some bullshit. Apparently this place is haunted. We cannot move that little, um, that man from my wall. But, you know, we have our dishes there, a trash can counter, cellular device, popcorn machine because we will be Netflixing and chill. One of my favorite parts of the kitchen, the decorations, of course. We have, of course, um, you know, alcohol. 
We have some cooking stuff and, you know, drinks, bread, books, some really cool stuff. I just love all the custom content. Like, look at it, you guys. Look at it. We got to have some fried chicken in the Aki Hall. Like, Aki Hall, we got to have the Aki Hall, okay? Pepsi, of course. Um, you, get, you get the gist, bitch. Yeah, we got to have, you know, cooking devices because of one that. And of course, cabinets. And we got our some, you know, our urban art. We got a thermostat, a light switch. And this is a rundown apartment, so it is some cracks on the wall, tennis shoes all over the place. Um, love conquers all, so yes, that is true. And of course, we're going to have our black love showcasing everywhere. So there, boom, here, boom, there, boom. And we have this nice little painting that's on the floor. It hasn't been hung up yet. We have a nice little couch and we have a microphone so she can to work on poetry because she's also going to be like a poet, you guys. I, ha I have not figured out her name yet. But yes, this is some of the shit we have. I didn't mean to say shit. I'm so used to cursing. Well, yeah. this is some of the shit we have on our um, coffee table. We have an iPad, cigarettes, um, watch, wallet, keys down there, magazine, beer cans, a bong with weed because, you know, gotta get high, gotta get lit, lit, lit. We got some good ass movies down there. I, uh, all these movies, the shit, I love watching them all. Players Love, Love Jones, what else? Um, set it off, my, my shit. We have another iPad with Netflix right there. A telephone, flash screen TV. We have the um, Apple, whatever. I, I don't have an Apple TV, so I bet y'all wouldn't know. We have some games right there. We have an Xbox right there, so that's cool. So, um, Adidas slides. What else? What else? What else? What else do we get? I guess we can go into our little bathroom, huh? Literally, little fucking bathroom. So, we have our light switches. This is our tub. Is it, it nice and nice? Our, um, you know, what is this? Um, rag. I mean, towel and, uh, oh, fuck. I mean, rope, rope. And over here on our counter, we have some, you know, soaps. You know, hair care products and picture. She got a flat iron. We have a scale there because I haven't been I haven't been that weight since about ten years ago. It's crazy. And we have a little toilet, toilet paper right there. And right here we have some cleaning supplies because why not? Like we gotta have the bleach, you know, gotta have it. So it makes everything look really um really nice okay guys so leaving out and please 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 feel free to buy a shirt please 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 so going into it this is a small ass apartment just to let you know but you know moving on up to the upper east side one day one day one day one day okay so coming into our room you open up the door you have some we're gonna go to the right first we have forever 21 and some jordans over here light switch cracks in the wall again still we have a mirror we have some um, hair care products, lotions, um, colognes, notebook, pocketbook, you know, some just regular stuff so that they, you know, actually live here. Thing is the definition of love because this is what they believe in, love and good vibes only. Yes, that's all we need. We got our MacBook Pro laptop right there. We have, of course, some more weave, some out of more water, some cameras because, let's just say, they love taking pictures and they may even be vloggers. I don't. No, we gotta have some weave, of course. We gotta have the weave because <laughs> ratchet. But um, it's not even ratchet. A girl wanna look fly. Like, what's wrong with being fly? You know, ain't nothing wrong with that. Um, Mac, Bach, I don't know. But um, yeah, we got some clothes here because you know we gotta have shit to put on our backs. Nike's shoes. Um, you still moving in, so we got a little bit of stuff. Got some more shoes there over here. Sunglasses, more hair care stuff, wallet, a condom, of course, um, bed. Um, um, we got some Nike sh um, shoes. We have a watch, earphones, condom, vitamin water, um, hair, oh, you know, skin stuff, lotions, all that stuff. Down here, we got two Glocks. I don't know the terminology. I ain't about that life now. But um, Glocks is what they call it. <laughs> Pistols, guns, you know. Pow, pow, pow. We got some guns. I'll explain later. But yeah, we got guns, money, just some stuff for protection. So it's right there by the bed stand. And over here we have a laundry um, basket with some shoes. And of course, we got the shoes right there. Over here we have some heels. So she does live here, you guys. But she was in the shoes too. Some clothes. Another um, iPad. Mm -hmm. I think that's actually functional. 
The other ones were just decoration and some clothes and some more care products. And look at our nice little view of the nice little promenade. I think I don't even, I'm not even going to call it a promenade. But yeah, it's a nice little view. You can go outside and play basky, basketball. So over here, she has a little vanity where she can do makeup. So she has some shopping bags, cell phone, lipstick, makeup, perfume, all this cool stuff. There's some more money because you never know. And she had this picture, it always reminds her. Whenever she look up, she be like, damn, her bitch gotta get fly. So that gives her inspiration. We got a closet, of course, to woohoo in. And over here we have um, Boomerang with Eddie Murphy. So yeah, this is our home, our humble label, you guys. Oh, we have Love and Basketball up there on the wall, too, you guys. I hope you guys like the house. I've worked really hard on it. It, you know, it took me a minute. I worked so, 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 so hard on it. So let me introduce these sims to you guys real quick, real quick, quite fast. Let me see how long I've been recording. 10 minutes already. Cool. Wow. Okay, so we're going to start with our male sim. This is him right here. Eyes not even open now. Open your face, child. Open your face. But yeah, this is him. His name is um, Daquan or Daquan. I'm going to go ahead and Daquan. He has a little apostrophe right there. Um, um, Daquan Stewart. His um, traits are no chill, boyfriend material, home turf, and a stoner. So he is always high. And he is... Um, his um thing is city native so he like you know he's from the city grew up in the city and his ethnicity he is black and puerto rican so yeah that's cool he is a um ring leader in a criminal career that's level three so i wanted to have them already established i didn't i didn't want to have them just start off and learning everything i want them to know how to do some stuff so he's a ring leader he's a criminal he, aka he's going to be our drug dealer Doughboy, but you know, imagination people work with him. But you know, we're also gonna have him dip and dabble in a lot of different stuff. It's just we're gonna go as the series progress. I really I have a little set thing where I want to do with it, but you guys tell me also because you guys are the main thing when I'm recording. I'm doing this for you and also doing it for me secondary, but I'm doing it to entertain you guys as well. So he works in three days, that's cool. His skills are um, charisma. He has a level two skill in charisma. Let's start the highest fuck. His influence is level five because as a criminal, you need to have good influence. He has video gaming at level four um, because you know he did grow in life. He's not just like poop. He was just created, so he has some skills. Fitness is level three. Mischief is level three. Photography is level three. Sex is level three. <laughs> charisma is level two. Dancing is level two. Debating is level two. So he has some skills, but he also has room to improve some. So these are the only two people that he knows. So far, I put some more people in the town. Also, you guys can create people for me on a gallery using the hashtag Tariq the Titan. And I will check them out, and I will put them in the town. But we have some people that I want them to become friends with. You know when you see them because they look like, oh, these are some fly-ass sims. And then you got these some um, ugly-ass sims from EA, okay? He has a brother and a sister who you guys will see soon. But they are nowhere to be found, actually. And he, I don't know why he doesn't know them. Let's just say he's estranged from them. But this is his sister, Kayla Stewart. She's a little bit ratchet, but I like her. And then we had DeAndre Stewart. So we're going to have to go visit them. I don't know why he doesn't know them. Let's just say he don't really mess with them like that. Because they're crazy. Like, they're crazy as shit. But, you know, they're cool nonetheless. So let's go over to... um. Keisha Harris, and they are boyfriend and girlfriend, you guys, if I haven't already said that. So, Keisha Harris, she, let's just look at her family tree. Her mother is in town, so her mother is Chantel Harris, and she has a, I don't, I didn't give her a job, I'm sorry. I, I'll give her a job later, but right now, let's just say she make good money. She living in the Upper East Side, where the fuck we need to be, but she is girlfriend material to match his boyfriend material, if that makes sense. Um, she is a siren. She likes being flirty and likes being in love. She's lit, lit, lit. You know, she can throw down. She can party. She could always, you know, hang with the best of them. And she's domestic. So she's a pretty, you know, she's a pretty good girlfriend. So she knows her mom. She has a good relationship with her mom right now. But the mom doesn't know the boyfriend. So that's the tricky part. And they're not going to have the best relationship, you guys. Not at all. So let's look at her skills. 
she has a level five in debating because she can get that fucking point across and she can make sure she, you know, whatever she wants, she can fucking get it. She also likes to sing for fun, maybe for tips. I don't know. I like, I really like that trait. So most of my sims are always going to be fucking singers. She's a photography, so she's also going to be doing some Instagram modeling or whatever. And, um, influence because, you know, she has to have influence on him. Cooking is going to be level 4. Dancing is level 4. Sex is level 3. Writing is level 3. Charisma is level 3. Comedy is level 3. And Mixology is level 3. So she's going to be mixing some drinks to make money as well. Just to do some stuff. And Fitness is level 2. Mistress is level 2. And Logic is level 2. I just gave her some skills. Nothing is too high. And so that she can still, you know, go out in life. And still, you know, try to upgrade. So she's going to be in a fashion career. I know it seems like you just did this stupid shit, bitch. In um, City Living. But... You know, we didn't make it that far in City Living. So, she's level three in a fashion career. So, she's a brand um, res um, representative. So, that is going to be cool, cool, cool beans. Now, let's actually get into it and put the walls down and have the press play and have them do some stuff. Like, I don't understand. We got Wicked Whims, of course. Let's, um, have a, you know, you guys can tell I've been cheating because they ain't even had a damn first kiss yet. Find you, Spino. Yes, Working one minute, bitch, you crazy. Barbie taxi, watch you. Hot dope. Yeah, Hot fuck out of here. Behind, what are you talking about? Um, I forgot his name. Daquan. Daquan. Okay, how the fuck? I oh, hate us. They're having their first kiss. Isn't let's just say the first kiss in a new apartment, <laughs> because they've been going everywhere. Um, milestone complete. Complete. The fuck? Okay, so her aspiration is family. It's from season... I mean, it's from The Sims 2. And it says to be a young adult or elder. Okay, that's fucking easy. Get engaged and get married. All right. So, I don't know what she's about to do to him now. Kiss him again. And, you know, brown sugar, baby. Brown sugar. What you trying to do? I don't know what you're trying to do right now, but let's just... First of all, let's start your little blog. Can we have a blog? Because I would love for her to do that. I want you to, um... Come here and I want you I don't know I would like it if you can start a blog. You probably would have to do social, wouldn't you? Socialize No. Oh she can't do that. Okay, well you're gonna write and work on um practice writing. So she could do her poetry shit. And I want you to come out here and play your video games just for a little bit. Um, play this by a racing game. We actually need to go out and meet some friends because this shit need to be more lit than what it is. Can you sit down and play video games, please? Like, sit, please. Thank you. Because do what I do. What I would do. Thanks a lot. What is the next? Says my son's racing. This some damn Mario Kart. Sonic the Hedgehog, I don't know. Pac-Man. So this is real cool. It's like, I don't know. It's just real chill. I want to do something that's chill. That I don't have to be like, oh, I really want to play, but I can't play. But yeah, I want to be out of school in like two weeks. We live. I'm going to be gone by the 19th, so I have like two weeks left. I couldn't record anything, and tomorrow, hopefully, my roommate does not show up um, later on. This oh my god, bitch. We had people here to visit. Oh, this is the brother. I believe. Oh, I turned on the um, headline effects. Your brother is here. No, these are the. Okay. Is this the fucking brother? I don't know who this is. I I I, I turned on the headline effects, so it doesn't show the name. But motherfuckers is at our door, so I'm guessing the bitch want to talk. Why don't you come over here and have her meet her and just be a new friend, flirty. Do funny. This is Khalil. Okay, he's our neighbor. The fuck? Khalil oh, I thought it said Khalil um Harris. I was like, he's not related to us. This is Khalil um Heavens. He is our neighbor. Everybody's rocking the white right now, so this is him. You know, lit right now. He is obviously a stoner too. Look at them red eyes, man. Look at those red eyes. But look at those tattoos. Like he look lit as fuck. Come in our house because we wearing the same goddamn shirt, bitch. 
He got his, I always got the eyes closed, but you guys, you guys like him? You guys like my Sims? Let me know. This is our other, um, um, neighbor. I don't know why the fuck she threw her trash out there. Like, I really don't want to have a problem with her. She's like a cool, cool, like, she cool ghetto and ratchet. Like, look at this cigarette in her hand, y'all. He always got her ass closed. Like, this shit is crazy. Ugh, every time I stop the game. Yeah, but she's really cool. I think these two are boyfriend and girlfriend, to be quite honest. Or they're just living together or just <laughs> just fucking. I don't know. But, Keisha, why don't you go over there and talk to them? Please and thank you. Why don't you have a friendly introduction with her? Please, 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 Keisha, please. Why the fuck did you throw your trash out there? You know, I'm not really trying to have an issue here. I'm going to turn the headline effects back on because I need to know people's names. Can you come here? Because you're pissing me off. What the fuck is the problem? What the fuck is the problem? You know what? You walked in, but she can walk out. I'm not understanding. I'm really not understanding why she can't fucking get out of here. But it is the first part lesson I did this, Keisha. Please. So why don't you um friendly introduction to him and a friendly introduction to her. Why are you standing here right now? Why don't you do a friendly introduction to her? Because these are going to be our fucking friends. Like, these are going to be our lit-ass neighbors yeah, that we can party and turn out with for real, though. Like, this yeah. is China. Like, yeah. China's going to be a cool-ass chick, you know? And, you guys, we're going to hopefully, you know, hopefully no fuck shit goes on in a series where it's, like, some infidelity. But I don't know. You guys know how I am. It might just fucking happen. But you guys tell me what you guys want, want them to do and want, want to see them do. And hopefully the goal is for her to start her own boutique later on in life. I will be rolled down with that, you know. Like, later on for her to do that. Why don't you debate video games? Okay, let's not get too fucking comfortable now. Walking into my house like that, yeah. Walk out. Everyone's out here. You need to be out here too. Oh. Khalil, let's not get get it twisted. China. So we're gonna gush about our partner because that's what the that's what we do. Um, we're gonna gossip about the neighbor, about the other neighbor who just threw his trash out. Like, what the fuck? Get to know her. What if China be like, you a messy ass bitch? <laughs> it is what it is. Um, that's about the day, you know, you just let these people give insightful advice. What, what y'all scared for? Bright and day. Like, for real though. Keisha learned to follow Trace about China. She's a foodie, so no wonder she a foodie. Look at, look at that ass. Look at, look, 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 look. look. Look at that ass. Look at that ass. No wonder she's a foodie. But I mean, yeah, it's a cool ass one. Um, Daquan, why are you... Why do you feel the need to be the freaking person? Okay. Alright, I didn't see the purpose of picking it up to throw it in another... In another spot. But I mean, it is what the fuck it is. Um... Would you guys like to come inside, like, for a drink or something? I'm getting real fucking tired of this. I would like to get a cup of water. We can get emotional aura, of course. Like, why not? I would love to get a, like, a drink. Dag dag. Dag dag. <laughs> they always do that shit. So, girl, what's going on? Let's talk about um, property values. Let's talk about cooking. Let's talk about, um, ask about love life. Be like, are you fucking him? Or is he just, like, what the fuck? Couple more her little outfit. It ain't shit, but I mean. I mean, she relaxed. She relaxed. I was told that my Sims always look like they're going to the goddamn club. So I was like, let me tone it down some for everyday wear. Come on, China. Are you flirting? China, are you going to smoke that cigarette in your hand? Or are you just going to keep holding it? I just want to know. 
Joe. He's feeling very happy right now. He's like, it's just a cool ass place to live, you know? It's just, it's really nice. I'm, I'm really feeling it. But, um, get to know him a little bit. Be like, hey, bro, we're gonna, we gonna be real cool, you know? Okay, what the fuck is going on? Babusabe? That's their apartment. They live right there. So he's a stoner. Hey, my nigga, my nigga. We're stoners together, like, for real, though. Stoners together. Can you fucking come back? Discuss fitness, even though he probably ain't that fit. Give a compliment. And be like, yo, your chick bad as fuck. And he'd be like, hey, watch it. I don't like that China, I mean, that China just went to our house without us, and that Keisha is just out here looking like she's fucking flirting, like, I don't know what. What are you talking about? You know what, Keisha? Stop having a group conversation. Come in here and sit and chat with China. Sit with her. Please. Why is she all up in the conversation? Breaking her neck. What the fuck are you talking about? Look, girl. Talk to um China ass. We have, we have a... No, we don't have a dark thing in here. Um, ask about favorite art. They'll be like, because you know I, I like to write, right? So let's see if he can actually use the toilet. Yeah, it works. Oh, pants went off. Yeah. Everything works. I'm, I'm really liking it. So we got politics. So we can um, debate laziness. Oh, let's debate distractions. Because we, we can just be like, you know, this toe is a distraction. Da -da -da. Okay, he needs to get the fuck off our computer because that's not for him. Please, this is not your strategy. You don't have to fucking do it. Um, what can we eat? Because I feel like he getting a little bit hungry. Or irritable. It ain't shit for him to do, really. But, um, what does he need for his job? Because I know he is a ringleader. So he need mis mischief. So let's start. I don't know. We just met his ass. I don't know. Well, let's be. Let's, I don't know. let's claim to be. Ooh, we could pickpocket. I know we just fucking met him, but. This is something that needs to happen, you guys. It really needs to happen. We just met him, but the shit needs to go down. Come here. Nibs, he's gone. Oh, gift to me. How is he? How, it's fucking frozen, bitch, bitch. Oh, 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 oh 99. No. Oh, I should really get going now. Thanks for hanging out with me. See you soon. 99 Samoans. It says, um, pick a pocket successful from a work event. Subtle is the name of the game. Oh, subtlebility. There's nothing like a rush of sneaking up on a sim and revealing them of their valuables. I know that shit is correct. So let's do another mischief. We can, um... Hmm. We have a lot to do, huh? So how about we, um, start a rumor. He's gonna be really fucking messy. I just know it. Oh my gosh. Um, let's give... Let's claim to be... No, not yet. No, this we want this to be our friend. Like, let's not do that just yet. Beam. <laughs> but what's going on out here, you guys? Yeah, you fucking suck. Um, Kendra. Her name's not Kendra. I don't really know her name. She don't know what to do with her life. She's like, this apartment is so fucking little. I just don't know much. But we have the research. Why don't you serve up breakfast or something? Serve lunch. I'm gonna let's just make um Hmm What can we do? Why don't you just serve up some BOTs like that's that's cool, right? BOTs. So we can have that to eat later. It's cool, cool shit, cool shit, cool shit. Daquan. Why don't you ask your little buddy if you were still leave, you know? Oh, sorry, Be like, I'll hang with you later. See you later, bro. Hang with you later. It's been real. You have to get the hell out now. He's like, really? Me? 
you want me to leave? Yeah. You should really get going now. Yeah, you really should. Oh, but this is not the front door. Is there something wrong with the room? Wait, what is it? It's really bothering me, to be quite honest. Like, I really don't know how they get in there, but they can't leave out. What is the fucking problem? You know what, guys? I'm going to fix the problem, but I'm going to end the part here. Thank you all for watching so much. If you enjoyed the first part of Brown Sugar, please give it a big thumbs up, a like, favorite, subscribe, all that good stuff. It would mean the world to me, you guys. Thanks for watching, and I'm going to go to sleep right now, but I'm going to try to record more in the morning, and I'm going to try to record The Walking Dead before I have to wear belt finals, okay? I have been so stressed out, but... This was nice, it was cool, it was chill, we got to learn a lot and introduce these new sims. If you guys are excited for a new episode, let me know and comment down what you think might be the issue with the door, because I don't fucking know. I may just put an archway in there. Or uh, tell me what you guys want to see in the upcoming future. Tell me if you guys like the house and the clothes and the new friends that we met, okay? It would mean the world to me. And also, buy my merch, um, check out my vlog channel, all that good stuff. Thanks for watching. Love you all so much. Like, it means the world to me. Peace.